Hey, I'm Vincent. Today I'm going to be showing you how to install PTC Creo 8.0. If you prefer to follow along, you can you can watch this video. If you prefer to just read the documentation and see how it's installed instead, you can always just look at this file over here and it and you can access it using Creo 8 installation steps in your Google Classroom. So first you want to press either this link or this link here. One is to log in and one is to create your account. You have two options when it comes to this. First, you can log in using 3D Caster's own account and it is right here. You can just copy and paste the username and the password. Or if you want to create your own education account, you can always click on the second link below and you can fill in the information to create that account. Now, for this video, we're going to be using 3D CAD Master's account. So we're going to copy and paste the password and the username if you have if it isn't already in here and you are going to log in. You're going to look at the export agreement and you are going to agree. And in this case we're going to be installing Creo 8.0. So depend so we're going to look at Win64 DVD. And we're going to click on the HTTPS. And this will install the file below. So we're going to wait for this file to finish. Now this next part is completely optional dependent on whether you've installed a previous version of Creo before. If you haven't and this is your first time installing Creo, you can skip over this step, which is step two. If you have, then follow along. So you're first going to copy and paste this directory into the one above and you're going to see if you have a previous license. I do because I previously installed Creo. In this video specifically, I'm going to delete it. And that's what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to delete your previous licenses. And with that done, we can now start installing Creo. Now we're going to install Creo. So after you download the file, it should show up in your downloads folder. From here, you should, you should click on it and you should extract all. And you can press on a directory or where you want to save that extracted file. I already extracted it for time saving purposes. So after you finish it, you want to open up the place where you extracted it to. From here, you're going to press on setup. And you're going to click yes. And this should show up the Creo installation assistant. You're going to click next and press on to install new software. It should automa automatically be selected for you already. And then you're going to accept the software license agreement and you're going to click this button right here and go on. Now we're, we've reached the license identification. Now we're going to install a license. First, you're going to click on this node right here, and then you're going to put the license. The license code is in the document here, and you can copy and paste it right here. So control C, and then control V, and then you will click on install licensing. Now you're going to need an account for to, to install this license. Now you can just use your old account or whatever account you created. In this case, I'm going to use the 3D CAD Masters account. Like so. And then you're going to wait for it to install. After you install the license, you are now finished with the licenses area and you should see it under here where it says source in status. You're going to click next and then you're going to select what you need to download. Now I'm just going to keep it by default and it will vary based on what you're trying to install. But I'm just going to keep it as is and click on next. And it's the same here. It's up to you whether you want to install any of this at all. In this case, I'm just going to leave it as is. 
So I'm going to click install. And now we're going to wait for all of it to install. And now finally, you click on finish, and you should be complete.